The streets in Christchurch are littered with bricks. The buildings above ripped open by the massive jolt that struck just before dawn. Oh my gosh, well that, that shake lasted oh, oh, probably over a minute. 75% of this city of nearly 400,000 people is without power. The hospital is running on a generator and countless water pipes have burst. The 7.0 magnitude quake hit at 4.35 Saturday morning. Frightened New Zealanders huddled in the streets after fleeing their homes in their pajamas. My house was completely swinging um, from side to side and I could hear lots of banging and noises crashing around everywhere. Despite being the same size as the quake in Haiti that killed 230,000 people, the damage here is much less due to better building codes, fewer people and the time of day the quake hit. People were home. They weren't walking around in the streets past brick buildings. Earthquakes are not rare in New Zealand. The country has around 14,000 quakes each year, but only about 150 are felt and less than 10 do any damage. As the sun rises, aftershocks continue to hit the area, jolting this already shaken city. Ben Tracy, CBS News, Los Angeles.